Rescue crews are working right now to save people who could be trapped in flooded homes and buildings left in the ruins there. CBS's Christian Benavidez is in Kissimmee with the latest. Near Fort Myers, search and rescue teams brought residents of Sanibel and Captiva to safety and scoured the barrier islands for signs of life. The so people that were surprised by how quickly the storm turned and ended up being trapped. Hurricane Ian's massive storm surge ripped away large parts of the Sanibel Causeway, cutting off access by land. Across Florida, the destruction can be seen from the air for miles around. At the storm's peak, Naples Fire and Rescue had to break the window of this car to pull a woman to safety. Throughout much of the state, people are assessing their losses and counting their blessings. I'm trying to be brave. After Ian made landfall as a Category 4 hurricane Wednesday with sustained winds of 150 miles per hour, it tore apart this Fort Myers trailer park. I literally watched my house disappear with everything in it. In this Central Florida retirement community yesterday afternoon, airboats with rescue crews were a welcome sight. I didn't realize they had a storm until they told me. I was sweet. Here in Kissimmee near Orlando, the city has implemented a mandatory curfew from 9 p.m. to 6 a.m. because of major flooding in all the county, says Ian, dropped more than a foot of rain. We're going to do our best to build Florida back as quickly as possible, but we're not going to be leaving. We're At FEMA headquarters back. in Washington, Maybe President back. Biden said as soon as conditions allow, he will visit Florida and Puerto Rico, which was ravaged by Hurricane Fiona just days ago. Cristian Benavides, CBS News, Kissimmee, Florida. Well, as things start opening up and recovery efforts continue, we are here to help you. You can text the word HOME to the number on your screen, 727-577-8522 for openings, resources, power outages, other crucial information about Hurricane Ian and the recovery efforts now underway.